Hey everybody, this is Desire Only, and first of all, I just want to go ahead and apologize for my other video because I know that on my camera in the back, since this case, I don't really like this case, and I wish I could take it back, um, but I misplaced the receipt, so I can't take this back, so I guess I'm stuck with it, but um, it's the same case that was in my Best Buy haul, but anyways, I want to apologize for that because on the back, camera I used to record that video it was covered so it was covered partially so like only half of it like see like you can only maybe see that much of it so but anyways okay so I just want to elaborate on that video that I showed you um and this video is going to be the second part to that video but the first these videos are going to be titled um i guess the low riders pull your pants up or something like that i don't know i'll conjure up something but i wanted to talk about this because it's really irritating um okay so these guys that walk around here they wear their pants halfway off their asses and they think it's cute and it's cool and blah 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 and that's all well and good okay but you know what there's a certain limit to all the shit that you can do okay and I'm just being honest um, I don't like to sugarcoat stuff so I will not do that but there's a limit to what you can do and that has beyond past my limit because a lot of people don't know this but when you wear your pants halfway off your ass in jail I don't know if anybody knows this and if you do then hey you're getting a little history lesson repeated again but if you don't this is a little history lesson for you in prison if you wear your pants like that that means that you are available for anal sex with another male. Yeah, so I know that's hard to mentally process, you know, but that's what that means. If you wear your pants down like that in prison, that means that you are available for anal sex with another male. Um, I would really love to know where they came up with this idea that that's cool to do that because honestly, it's really not. Um, sorry about that, there's something on my camera, lens, so, okay. But it's really not, and I just wish you all that do that crap, I wish you would go sit down and take notes, find a seat, sit your ass in it, and take some damn notes, because seriously, that's ridiculous. When you walk around somewhere with your underwear showing, because you think that that's cool to walk around like that, first of all, you look like an asshole, um, and secondly, I assume that you're gay if you do that type of stuff because, like I said, in jail, that means that you're available for anal sex with another male. Yeah, I know that's hard to process, but that's what it means. So, cut the crap, sit down somewhere, take notes <clears throat> because it's disgusting. It, and a lot of people here back a few years ago, maybe two or three years ago, they tried to pass a law where if you were a male and you wore your pants under your ass and your underwear showed, you get a ticket. And I wish that law would have came into play because I'm going to need you to park your car because that's ridiculous. But I wish that law would have came into play because when you see all these people that walk around with their underwear showing... That really makes you think what society is about, plain and simple. I just think society is so low, and it makes us look bad as Americans. They, people wonder why all these other countries like Great Britain and the United Kingdom and France and all these other places talk shit about us, because they used to talk shit about, oh, well, all of us Americans are fat and we're lazy and blah, blah, blah. That might be the case. 
Um, but hello, we don't sit over there and talk crap about other countries like that. So come on, you can talk all the shit that you want to. That's all well and good. But seriously, that makes us look bad as a country, as a, a, as a United Nation. Not even a United Nation, a United States, I guess. It makes us look truly bad, and I just wish people would realize that it's not cute, it's not cool. Um, if you were to go to jail and you did that shit, you'd be having anal sex with another male real quick. Somebody would make you their bitch, and I'm not even playing, so. So, just do not do that. Seriously, pull the damn pants up. Is it that hard to go out and get a belt? String it through the loops, hook it in the front, go about your day. Is it really that hard? Okay. Oh my God, I can't go out and buy a belt because I think it's more cool to go and wear my pants under my ass. Are you serious? Get a belt. Okay. Get a belt. If you don't have one, I will surely go to the Goodwill, send you one. Let me know. PM me to do something because that's ridiculous. I hate when I drive down the street and I see some bullshit like that. Seriously. Where. And especially women wear underwear okay I understand this too there are women out there who go around and they don't wear underwear there are women out there that go around and don't wear bras first of all that's all right if you don't wear underwear because that's you but when you walk down the street and all this is jiggling everywhere one titty's over here the other one's all the way over there just put a bra on, ma'am. Okay, seriously, I'm so sorry to any of my subscribers who got offended or if they feel offended, but you know what? Wear a bra, okay? I don't need to drive down the street, and I know this is hilarious to some people, but I just really do not need to walk down the damn street or drive down the street and see some woman just jiggling all over the place. Um, oh, yeah, you know what? Hey girl, yeah, I'm just walking down the street and all my breasts are all over the place. One's over on the right, one's over to the far left, blah, blah, blah. One's all the way over in New Hampshire and the other one's all the way in California. Girl, blah, 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 let me tell you. Seriously, okay, get a bra, wear some underwear, put a belt on. Don't show your underwear to all of us because that, I don't need to see your underwear. I don't need to see you jiggling all over the damn place because first of all, I, that is not what I want to see. So, I just really feel like that makes us as a United States nation or whatever you want to call it, the, you know, all the state. I, I just really think that that makes us look bad. That we have to walk around here half damn naked. Sure, you wear clothes, but whatever happened to bras? Try a bra, ma'am. Try some underwear. Try a belt for all you guys because seriously that makes you look gay. I mean, I'm sure, I know most of you aren't, um, but there are some people that are on the down low, so they can do that, and um, hey, be ready for anal sex if you go to jail, I'm, that's all I'm saying, so when you go to jail, don't say I didn't say so, because that's what it is, so if you got offended, hey, if there's an unsubscribe button, you can go do that, don't care. But that's ridiculous when you walk down the street and you, if you're walking down the street or driving like I was in my other video and you see some shit like that, that makes you really wonder what the hell we as Americans have come to. And just think about it and put your comments below, make a video response, do whatever you have to do. I would really love to hear you guys' opinions on this because really, it's disgusting. So... With that being said, everybody have a great day. I'm going home. First day of classes was interesting. My psychology teacher, I love her to death. Oh my God, she is so hilarious. So, with that being said, have a great day. There might be another video tonight. I'm not sure, but if not, I'll be talking to you guys tomorrow. And I need to go put on some lip balm. Because my lips are all chapped as hell. So, mm -mm. so, yeah, so everybody have a good day. I'll be talking to you guys later. If not, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye.